Horseback archery is a sport that requires a steady hand and a calm mind. Used as far back as medieval times and by Mongols and Turkic warriors in warfare, the sport now seems to have found a foothold in South Africa. We've got about 30 riders on the books. We compare very well internationally. We had a huge international competition in Hungary about a month ago where South Africa plays seventh out of 25 countries. So we're performing very, very well internationally. Competitions consist of three shooting disciplines. The main ones is firstly the Korean track, which is targets placed on ground level. You have one shot per target. Then the second one is the Hungarian. That's a huge three-phase target where you can shoot as many arrows as you can. And then the third one that we're doing here is called the Kabak. It's an aerial target, seven meters up in the air, and you shoot at a disc with a diameter of 40 centimeters. Arrows in hand, feet in stirrups, mounted archery is an adrenaline-charged sport. It's not an easy sport. It's actually, it's very difficult. Riding this horse and concentrating on a target, taking the mind off the horse, it's, it's an amazing adrenaline rush. No one knows more about shooting arrows from a speeding horse than these local archers. You have to be one with your horse. Many guys talk about the zen of archery. So you get into a, into a zone where you just switch off and you do your archery. So your horsemanship needs to be at very high point as well as your archery. You'll see that everybody does a different style. They shoot different bows, different arrows, um, different saddles. So um, in terms of technique, anything goes. When it comes to mounted archery, Hungary tops the rankings in international competitions. But South Africa is hoping to grow the sport and is sending a national junior and senior team to compete in Korea next month. Judy Shara, CGTN, Pretoria, South Africa.